What's up guys, it's Kim here. And I know what you're thinking, um, for a spy trick video, not more TF, uh, you know, not, not more TR walkway. Because, I don't know, if you're like me, I hate TR walkway videos. Uh, they're usually all the same thing, teaching you how to, you know, stab people. But this one's going to be different. Because I'm going to say, I don't do normal, um, normal walkway training where you have them all set up and walk. I like to do is what you do make them spawn I'll show you how to do it so you make them spawn every second and a half that way you it's really it's good for getting your reflux better you look like things like this work really good and there's, there's gonna be stuff like that where you miss your stabs it happens to everyone but I actually like to put it on one one a second I just I like that better that's what it's on right now but at first I thought that was a little too fast so you can come over here and start with whatever you want. Some people do two seconds, but that's what you want. That's pretty slow. I mean, one and a half is decent. But, I mean, one doesn't let you do all the stabs. Like, I, I for one right now, I can't get off multiple um, backwards stair stabs at once. So just, I'm not that fast. But if you're like this, you can usually get them done. Let's see. Just be like and practice. And see so you get them. And eventually you're gonna do things like that and it really does it's probably the only TR walkway training I've ever done that actually helped me in a game because when I was in uh, games and you do stair stabs and what you do is you see that NG coming and you, you can't do things like that in the game it just doesn't work it's a lot harder you know you, you really get choked up during the game but this training if you can get it really fast get it up to at least one second and just land at least 30 stabs in a row, you'll be able to do it in game, no problem. It, it really helps. Uh, gun, it good. I wouldn't recommend ambassador training on TR walkway, to be honest with you. It's convenient, but the, their uh, hitboxes are broken. Like, really bad. So, the head here is not what the head's gonna be, you know, in a real match. And I'm missing everything. It also really helps with stabs, because sometimes, say if you miss your jump, you're going to roll off their head like that, and you can use that to get stabs, and that's really good as a spy. I've done it in games before where I've missed up my step and get blown in the air by, say, a soldier, and then use the momentum from that rocket to get over his head and get the stab. But stuff like that really does work. You just have to have a lot of training, and really just get reflexes as fast as possible. I do this, though. This is really good practice. Instead of going like this, just go in between and weave your way in and out. It really helps. But I'm, I'm gonna go into uh, different stabs. I'll probably go into stair stab because that's the one I can show you in this video. I'll probably do another video on matador stabs. A good way to practice for that is on dig root keep, also known as medieval mode. That's great for practicing matadors. Play a few matches of that, you'll be getting matadors in no time. I actually, I actually like to do this, uh, this specific training, uh, before every Highlander match. It's really good. See, it says you don't want to be doing things like that in a game, so might as well get your fell stabs out now and do it in the real game where it matters. But yeah, that's that's uh, that's a lot. I want to show you how to actually do a stair step now. So what we're gonna do. Well, let me go slow it down, actually, because this is a bit too fast for a lot of people. You are going to want to do this, though. Come over here, hit that to the red, and then pick where you want where you want the bots to spawn, and they'll keep spawning in a line like that. This is what I recommend for practicing any kind of stabs that you're new at. Do a two-second uh, delay. Oh, I'm gonna fail. Drop stabs up there. You can do uh, little stabs over there of those steps. Alright, so what you're gonna do is you're gonna jump and crouch at the same time. So you go over their head. Like that. You can do actually a real small incline too, like that. Those are the ones that work the best. And what you're gonna do after you jump over their head, some people like to turn like this. It's a lot of disadvantages. The one you saw right there, you can jump a lot too far. It's bad. And what you want to do is jump and then turn as you're going over their head. 
So I'll show you. Like that. And I, I do, I turn it all the way around a lot of the times, sometimes I don't, but during games I tend to, because if you over, if like say if you over jump it, turning, you want to turn more, you know, at a certain angle. Then as if you, say if you want to jump perfectly, you can get it just like that. But most of us will, you're going to over jump. So just, you know, turn around accordingly. Yeah, I'm missing a lot more steps than usual because I have pushed the talk on my mic because I don't want to hear background noise. So, it's kind of hard to hold three buttons at once while stat. But yeah, once you get that basic movement down, start doing the uh, the advanced trading. That definitely helps. I, I even couldn't, I couldn't get real good stair steps down really at all. But then once I did the intense stuff, it really, really helps you out a lot. Stabs like these would work in game because no one's gonna, you know, everyone's gonna expect a jump, a jump stab for like that. See? So, what you gotta do is get right here on a little angle, kinda like this. Work. It just goes to the practice. Like I said, I'm gonna be doing a video on Matador stabs because those are really important. Basic step like that too, we're good. We're we'll, uh, straight for sense. But yeah, that's pretty much about all for this video. If you have any questions about this, um, go ahead and put them in the comments. I'll answer all of them. I work to the best of my ability. And just keep practicing, and eventually you're going to land tons of them in game. People will be wondering what's going on with this guy, what's he doing? You're going to be, be pub stopping in no time. Alright, so that's all. Thanks for watching. Remember to leave a comment, rate, subscribe, and I'll see you next time in the Matador Slayer video. Thanks for watching.